Our top story this afternoon, the son of the late half-brother of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un is reportedly in Malaysia to claim his father's body. Reports say Kim Jong-nam's son underwent a DNA test at the request of the Malaysian government. The question of what happens with the body is causing diplomatic friction between North Korea, Malaysia and also China. Kim mok yeon starts us off. Arriving in the early hours of Tuesday morning, Kim Jong-nam's son, Kim Han-sol, arrived at the mortuary of the Kuala Lumpur Hospital and confirmed the body was that of his father. To protect his identity from being exposed to the public, Kim Han-sol disguised himself as a special police officer on his way in and out of the hospital. During his hour-long stay, Kim also reportedly underwent some tests to check if his DNA matched with Kim Jong-nam's. Kim Han-sol's trip to Malaysia came a day after Malaysian authorities said they would only hand over Kim Jong-nam's body to direct family members whose ties with him can be proven through a paternity test. If their genes are proven to be related, Kim Jong-nam's direct family members will be able to claim his body. North Korea has angrily protested the move as it wants to take his body back to Pyongyang. The situation is likely to raise tension between North Korea and China as pundits say Kim Han-sol's trip to Malaysia was possible due to help from the Chinese government. Since China has been protecting Kim Jong-nam's family members who are living in Macau, Kim Han-sol's visit can be seen as a sign that China is against North Korea's efforts to have the body flown to Pyongyang. Kim Mo-kyun, Arirang News.